Hi friends, welcome back to Nightcap Crafting. Today we're going to do a easy journal tassel. This was the one I made for my October daily. I'm going to make one today for my December daily. And I have some jumbo paper clips, some fibers, some ribbon, some twine, and my cute little charms from my friend Shannon. Thank you, Shannon. And so what I did what I did with this one was trim each strand down to about 20 inches and I went with some wintry colors since I didn't have really Christmassy colors so I just wanted to use what I had these these fiber samples I found on Etsy from a woman who turned out to be a local woman which was really nice that way I get a little sampling of all different textures and um, colors and um, there's some sparkly ones. It was a really, a really good purchase. I'm really happy with these. And they're very lightweight, as are the little charms. So though the tassel ends up being, it's a little bit bulky, it's definitely not heavy. And so just beating through here, me trimming all my bits until I get to a bunch that I'm happy with. And I like how that looks. I decided to use the twine to wrap the top. So here I'm going to, in a, in a second here, I'm going to slow the video down so you can actually see what I'm doing when I tie the fibers on the paper clip debating whether I wanted to use more more scraps. Those are also from Shannon. Thank you, Shannon. I did end up using the bottom piece. So what you want to do is pick up your, your bunch of fabric fibers and loop them over your finger. And then you're going to push that whole loop all the way through the, not all the way through, through the top of the um, paper clip. And I'm sorry, I go off camera a little bit because I couldn't see what I was doing. Pull your loop through. And once you're sure you have all of your strands, which I'm trying to do, pull your tails through the loop and then tighten. And voila, you have you have your little fibers on there and it stays quite secure I did that with my October daily tassel and it worked out just fine you'll get a little bit of extra security with the twine or whatever whatever ribbon you want to use on top to hang your charms from so I take my twine and wrap it around the top near the knot a few times and then double knot it and then my tails hanging down will have the charms on them. And those are attached the same way. I just I just double knot them. I thread thread the uh the twine through the charms and double knot it. And here I'm just kind of fussing with it to see where I want the charms to lay until I'm happy with it and then just double knot, double knot, give a little trim on the, I like to leave a little bit of a tail hanging on the bottom. I just like the way it looks. And then get the other guys on there, double knot. This whole thing took me about 15 minutes start to finish so it was a really easy project to do while I was watching TV. And then I decide to add just a little bit more. See, there you go. I add a little bit of my extra string on top just because it's pretty. And there you have it. Simple. Thanks for watching. Hope you liked it.